It's 5:30. A major step forward at a long-neglected project in one corner of the Tennessee Valley. We're talking about the Belfont Nuclear Energy Plant that has been around for quite some time, just sitting in Jackson County unused. But in just a matter of hours, we'll see the first major step in making that change. This morning, Way 31's Will Robinson Smith joining us live near the Belfont facility with a look ahead at what we should expect in the coming months. Good morning, Will. Well, good morning. What uh, people involved with the project really want to emphasize about it is that from the construction phase through its operation, that thousands of jobs will be brought to be working on this plant as it develops and as it begins to put out energy here in the Tennessee Valley. Now, the president and CEO of the Jackson County Economic Development Authority said that the plant will create more than 8,000 jobs and have an economic output of more than $12 billion. In a letter to the Trump administration from legislators that was published by AL.com last month, uh, Congressman Mo Brooks and others noted that 1,700 direct and 1,800 indirect jobs will be needed just during the pre-construction phase alone. Huntsville-based uh, engineering group Teledyne Brown Engineering announced on Friday that they will also be participating in this project. Of course, Way 31 is going to have a reporter here at the announcement, and we'll bring you the very latest both on our midday show live as well as on our website, waytv.com. For now, the reporting live in Jackson County, I'm Robinson Smith, Way 31 News.